if you trade GBP USD, this is video is for you because I want to do prediction of 2024 being the month of September. So this video will help you to project uh, what the outcome may be on GBP USD on October, November, and December. Like this analysis can help you to understand how GBP USD will behave in the next four months. So these are very important video. This is, these are not the video that you watch and then uh, you leave it halfway. No, these are the videos that you watch. And at the end of the day, you are determined to do exactly as the video says. Okay, guys. So in this video, I want us to really understand that you have to do uh, monthly, monthly analysis. You have to do monthly analysis, weekly analysis, daily analysis, for our analysis, so that we can have a clear picture of the right prediction in the next four months. So these are the videos that you need to watch and to understand what the market is up to. Okay, guys. So... I don't know if you have ever noticed that GBPUSD is sitting on a long-term double bottom. GBPUSD is sitting on a long-term double bottom. And that double bottom, I found it in the year. Let me show you. There's a double bottom here because you have to ask yourself, why did the market just stop there? Why did the market stop there? So if you want to see the long-term uh, double bottom, you have to use the broker FXCM. So the question is, why did the market stop here in the year 2022? And it has been struggling to go up. It's because we found this double bottom. So the GBPUSD has a long-term double bottom in the year 1985. So where the market touched 2022 is where the market was 1985. Those are so many years ago, more than 20 plus years. So that's what GBPUSD, you need to understand that it is currently sitting on a double bottom. And this double bottom, we are not sure that it will ever hit the neckline because this is the lowest the market has ever been. Uh, the lowest that the market has ever been is 1.03. So we are not sure if this market will eventually hit the neckline of that double bottom. If you squeeze it, you can see. So if you're using your phone, make sure you use the broker who is called FXCM for you to, to see them well, to see the, the data well. So this is the neckline, guys, and this is our double bottom. So this is our double bottom. These are long-term analysis. This is the prediction of 2024. And then we have the neckline. Like that, we have that neckline. And then we want to measure our half, guys. We want to measure our half. So for me, um, I'm still believing that GBPSD is on a journey and a long-term journey to hit 1.5805. That's what I believe. Like this market by December, by December we will have hit 1.5850 if pound continue to gain strength. So if I project how many pips are those, is 2,673. Remember, USD can be affected with the elections that are coming on, I don't know if it's October next month. And if pound gains power, I'm telling you, it will be a long-term buy. And I'm seeing where the market can go to 1.5850. And it's because the reason why I'm saying it can go more than 2,000, we have seen it 2,700 pips is because Anytime you have a double bottom, the market first go half of the distance. So half of the distance is you measure the distance of the half. And you can see that's exactly where the market is seated. 
I've ever done a video, I've ever done a video projecting the market will come to this level. I've ever done a video. Let's look at that video. Um, allow me to check that video. I've ever done a video of GBP USD. Let's see if we will find it. Because I did those analysis. Just type as free. GBP USD. I have ever done the video and you will hear what the analysis was about. So it was, this was uh, so many years ago, how to, it was about GBP USD will hit something like a thousand pips. And it was either a year ago. GBP USD. I had done so many videos on GBP USD, and that's why you should subscribe on my videos. I don't know if I'm sharing. Yes, I'm sharing, and you can see uh, the analysis. I, I, I think I love to trade GBP USD because most of the videos are telling me you can see here GBP USD. This was 11 months ago, we'll hit 1.25, 500 pips. Uh, 1.25, that one was for the daily, that double bottom, I remember it, it was a double bottom on the daily. I loved, I loved to analyze GBP USD. I love, you can see most of the videos are GBP USD uh, related. So if I don't see that video, I will I will look for it. I will look for it and then I will show you guys where I I predicted, like I did the video and it was the same double bottom guys. I don't think I can find it, but it is there. Anyway, let's go back to the video. Sorry about that. Let's go back to the video. So I'm um, I'm double sure that by the end of this year, even if we won't be at 1.58, let me tell you where we will be. We will be at, even if we won't be at, we will be at 1.3827. So at least the first, the first maybe month we can be at, this is like 598 pips the first phase, and then they can come. So I've divided it in three. So the market can 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 hit those levels by the time it is hitting 1.58. That's my prediction, guys. And the reason why I'm saying those are my prediction is because I'm using the double bottom. There's nothing much I'm using. I'm just using the double bottom. So those are my prediction, guys, that the market is on a journey to to get to 1.3835 or 1.45 or 1.51 or 1.58. So we are on that journey. And I'm so sure that with the analysis on the weekly, uh, the market is very bullish. It's just that we need to use lower time frame uh, for, for, for the market. So maybe by the end of this week, coming week, the market will go to 1.33. So maybe next week, the market can buy around 250 pips. So if I scale it down. So how would you take advantage of a buy opportunity on GBP USD? For me, what I can tell you is that number one, they can do a retracement. This market loves to do the retracement. The sell that is starting right now, it can, it can come to this area to create a possible double bottom. So don't, because it's a buy, you still need a plan to buy that market. You still need a pattern. So number one is the market can drop more than 300 pips to activate this double bottom. And it can be the, the double bottom that is being used. If you check here, there was a double bottom that we did a long time ago. And I think it's the, that one, I was telling people about 350 pips. You see this double bottom, I did a video. This double bottom, I remember doing a video and I told people that this market, and that's why I say people have to have patience. 
You see, this double bottom was Tuesday, October, 3rd October. This double bottom is was OPT. If you go on weekly, we didn't have that double bottom. You can see there was no double bottom. I told people, I did a video, and I told people, this double bottom eventually is coming to our neckline. You can see. So it, it was too fast to go to half. And that's why I have confidence even on the monthly uh, chart pattern. Once it went to half, it really stayed from November to April. So it took like six, seven months in one place before hitting uh, the, the, before hitting, it's called what? The neckline. And you can see the same neckline was broken. That's why I'm so confident that the neckline was broken. You can see the neckline was broken. And what we say is the neckline was broken. The market will eventually, you know, people forget these patterns you forget, but they will still continue. The market is about to do that distance. You see that distance. So in short, what we are saying is that the market has a potential of number one, if you are trading GBPS, the GBPS is on a buy, but you need to know how do you enter. So the first take profit is at 1.3699. And from where it is, it's more than 500 pips. 500 pips, guys. So it's you to ask yourself, yes, I have a pattern. Yes, the market has confirmed a buy. buy but how I am, am I entering being supported by lower time frame? How will I be supported by daily? How will I be supported by four hour. So if I go to the monthly, you can see that is the, the direction where I have marked where the market seems to go. If I marked it on the weekly, that's where the market seems to go. But daily is giving us exactly because of this double bottom. And I know majority of you, you have forgotten this double bottom. Let me show you the double bottom I'm talking about. I did a video and um, it was a very interesting video because I really, hey, it took time. It, this is the video, guys. This is the video. So, and as I was doing this video, I was um, hoping that the same double bottom, I hope I'm sharing. Let me make sure I'm sharing. So you can see the double bottom. Let me show you the double bottom. So this is the double bottom we did. Here is the here is where I'm showing the double bottom. This is the double bottom I'm showing, guys. And it was last year. I was showing this double bottom and I was telling people if it does this, this is exactly where I was saying it will go up to 1.31. This is the same thing, guys. So we marked this double bottom and mind you, we were just analyzing and I was trying to show people that that double bottom is not there. 1.206. Can you see it's the same, the same double bottom 1.2020. So we can see that double bottom. I told people what to expect. I did this video and I said, if at all you are, um, you can see it's the same. Let me let me do this. It's the same thing. I told people they wait for the green candle. Can you see? I told people to wait for a bearish, a bullish angle. And I think the following day, you see what I was saying. Let me play. You can see the half was at 1.2581, 1.2581. This is the same place where this half we were targeting. And I was telling people that if at all you get this, and this double bottom took 
after I analyzed in October, last year, October, it has taken, hey, August, October, November, December, Jan, Feb, March, April, May, June, July, August. A whole year for that double bottom to be completed. Oh my goodness. It has taken too much time. But you, you see, it's the best thing to know your analysis, to know where the market is flowing. It's the best thing to know how to, to, to analyze the market. And that's what I'm saying. We know GBP is this a buy eh? because it has to it has to come up to 1.3700. It has to. But how will we enter this market? So according to daily, if this market market can retrace, GBP is this notorious in retracing, it can come back here. But on four hour, I want you to go and mark all this support area because they will still use double bottoms to make this market go up. And all these double bottoms are OPT. So what I want you to do, I want you to mark these areas because something can happen on this zone. So these are the areas I want you to mark. And now use, we call what? Use CRB strategy. So we will be ready for the market. CRB strategy, okay? So those, that's how we will trade GBPUSD. I'm so eager to talk about it, to come here back again and give you. For now, I I know it's a buy up to, I know it will buy up to 1.37. I know it will buy up to 1.3699. But the question is, how do I enter this trade? What is the strategy to enter this market? That's what my question is, and I want a pattern. Anyway, thank you so much, guys, for watching. I hope you have enjoyed the video. You will understand that um, sometimes you may do analysis and it may take time. Like I did analysis here and I told you Euro USD is a sell, uh, is a buy because of a double bottom, Audis and the DCHF is a sell because of a double top. And majority of you didn't pay attention. But you see, those are the pips that were being given for free this week. All the best, guys. If you're interested in my course, just to tap me. Here is my number. Let me give you my number because people use, like, like scamming people, saying I trade on behalf. I don't trade. I don't trade Bitcoin. If you're interested to buy my course, this is my number. One, one strategy is $100. If you want the full strategy is $1,000. This is my number. You can WhatsApp me. All the best, guys. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.